All right, welcome back to the Crunch Concepts. My name is Nate Saji. We've got Mitch Bowers behind the camera here. Today we wanted to touch on a little bit of rowing, just to give you a little tip on that. Um, as you see in our workouts, if we ever have some rowing for time, um, if you want to get some quick meters in, what we want to do is we're going to set up here. We're still rolling. All right, welcome back to the Crunch Concepts. My name is Nate Saji. We got Mitch Bowers behind the camera here. Today we wanted to talk to you a little bit about rowing. Uh, what we want to focus on today, we're going to talk about rowing for distance and rowing faster. We're going to focus on the long stride. So we want to set up, make sure we're driving through our heels. We're going to take our hands out as wide as we'll go and then lock these hips in with our knees. So we don't want our knees crashing together. We want to make sure I got my strong base here. What we're going to do is make a full extension all the way back. And then the key is to take your time on the way in. Let it rev up and go all the way back. So what we don't want to do is this. And then we never let the rower actually rev up and get the resistance. So if you're rowing for distance or time, keep that in mind. Take your time on the way in. Get a long pull on the way out. Thanks for watching. We'll be back to bring you more tips in the future.